Now, let's start today with chapter six, lesson seven, which is talking about subtraction and remaining. And all of you, please open your book page 389. Subtraction with renaming. What do I mean by this one? Like, if you have, all of you now, please focus with me. If you have nine and one over six, minus two and three over four, what do you have to do? First step, as we did before, you will look at C and four, they are not the same. You will try to find the common numerator. After you find it, you will find that I multiply by three by three and six by two by two. Then nine and two over 12 minus two and nine over 12. So after I made them same or like the numerator, what do I have to do next? I get five, what do I have to do next? Five. You have to subtract the fractions. Yes. Five. So now look at here. Here we have two. And here we have nine. Can I subtract nine from uh, two? Uh, take nine from two? No. No. So now all of you, please focus with me. What do we have to do? You will now. Go to the first one. The first one is 9 and 2 over 12. Remember now, listen to me. 9 and 2 over 12. I will ask the 9 to give me 1. When the 9 give me 1, how it will be? It will be 8 plus 1. Is it right? So I cannot subtract. I can go to my line. I am here. Like can say like I am here. The, the, I am the, the fraction are the our children. The first child ask her or his father. Father, I cannot subtract from the second one. So the, his father, which is the nine, give him one. So the father will be eight and he give him one. So it comes like eight and one and two of 12. Is it clear up to now? Yes. Then next, the eight, the father, will be still the same. But the one, I will write it as one over one. Then, in or then I will add the one that I took it from my father to the children, to the child. Then how can I add two fractions if they have different denominator? Can I add them? No. No. So I will multiply the denominator and the numerator by 12. So it comes now like 12 over 12 plus 2 over 12. So I took one from my father. I get, it will be eight now. And this one, that's I took it from the, my father. Change it to be as a fraction as mine, which is one over one. Then I write with as my denominator, which is 12 over 12. Then it comes as eight and 12 plus two, 14 over 12. Now, after I changed my mixed number after I have a power I can come back here to subtract from the second one I can say I am 8 now with 14 over 12 minus 9 uh, 2 sorry and 9 over 12 then to 14 minus 9 is 5 over 12, 12 and over 8 12. minus 2 is 6. So 
So now, after I get a power from my father, I can subtract from the second number. Is it clear? Now let's solve another example. I will repeat. It's just, okay, okay. I will solve more, more examples. You will understand them more. Now all of you, please, open your book page 389. To practice for a race, Kara is running two and a half miles. When she reached the end of her street, she knows that she has already one, run one and five over six. How many miles does Kara have left to run? So the Kara is running two and a half. When she reached, she found that she ran only one and five over six. So how many miles did she have left to continue? You will subtract. You will subtract two and a half minus one and five over six. Two and a half minus one and five over six. Now, as we said before, here we have six, here we have two. Is there a number that I'm two? I get six. Yes. I get five. Is that yes. Yes. By what? By three? By three. By three. So now it comes like two and three. X minus one and five over six. Now, look at the fractions, the children. Can the children, three or six, subtract five minus six? Or can I take five or six from three over six? No, so we will no, take. We so what we have to do, I will go with... to my father, this is two. Okay, my father, they must give me one, only one. So my father now, they give me one and they will be one because one plus one is two. Yes. So now my father is one and here I am will be one and three over six. But yes, since the one six. from my father, this one, I have to change it to be child like me. So then I will write it as one over one. If I want to add, I must, they must have the same fraction as me, as mine. So here's times six and times six. Okay. Now then, six over six plus three over six. Six plus three equals nine out of six. Nine. Teacher, what's this page? Out of six. Which was this? In? I told you, 389. Teacher, which page is this? 389. Yeah, okay. Then go, then go to the, then, go to the other, so My father, how I will be? Uh, uh, one and uh, one. Uh, nine out of six. Minus one then, and five over six. Now, after my father gives me a power, I can fight anything. Nine minus five equals four. Four. Uh, six, one minus one equals zero. The so four over six. So zero and four over six, or you can say only is four over six. Now four over six, can I simplify it more? Yes. Yes. By two. Divide by two. two. Divide by two. Two, yeah. Divide by two. So it will be two. Three. No, oh. It will be two. Two out of three.
Here is another way, but you will get the same answers. So here is the steps. I am a mixed number. I want there's a second mixed number want to subtract from me. But when I start to subtract it from him, I found that I don't have a power to fight him. So I will ask my father to give me one power. When I take my the power from my father, to I just the, change it to be uh, as fraction as mine. Is the, is the whole number? Sorry? The father is like the whole number? Yes, the father is the whole number and the fraction is mine. Then I will ask my father to give me power. After he give me the power, I take the one from him and I will change this one to be fraction like me. Then I will add it to my fraction in order to fight the other numbers. Did you finish writing? Yes, teacher, I finished. No, okay. teacher, just a bit. Uh, French. Okay. Teacher? Yes. The, the, the question is the test word it will be easy. Yes, be so easy. Okay. Okay, now. So number this one here. Number one. Four and half minus three and four over five. Okay? The, well, the first step, Hunada, can you tell me what I have to do? Okay, teacher. Um, first of all, uh, if we're going to subtract, we can subtract one, uh, two, one minus four. So we we will call the father uh, of the one and the then... We... Look at the denominators. No, first look at the denominators. Do you have the same denominator? No, no, no. No, so... What you have to do? Um, I have uh, to multiply that by five and the other by two. Here by five? Yes. And here is by two. Bravo. The, uh, then um, it w the, um, well, uh, two multiply five equal ten. One multiply five equal uh, five, so it will be four, one, uh, five out of uh, ten, and the other one, five multiplied two equals ten, and uh, four multiplied five equal twenty. Uh, so, eight over. Yes, I mean eight over uh, ten. Oh, bravo. Uh, before you continue, please just a minute, girls. I asked Miss Summer. I will take five to ten minutes from her period. Okay. Uh, Okay, teacher. Yeah, continue. Now, okay. after that, can you subtract no. five from eight? No, teacher. So, no. so we will go to the father of uh, the five and uh, we will take from him one. It will yeah. be three plus one. Then we want it to be a um, fraction. So, we'll make it as one out of one. Bravo. Just a minute, just a minute. Oops. Then, uh, when we make it, uh, yeah, here we said it is three plus one plus five over ten. Then we should make it a uh, fraction, so we make it one over one. Yeah. Then, and then uh, we will um, should make uh, like uh, should make uh, the one like the other so we multiply it by 10 and multiply it by bravo good job 10. by 10 by 10 yeah but yes. then the... it will be 10 out of 10 yeah 3 plus 
10 or 3, 10 out of 10. Plus 5 out of 10. Bravo. Then 3 and? Th 3 and 15 out of 10. Bravo. Then we will now, go, uh, we will return to the m subtraction and then we will minus 3 out, uh, 3, 15 out of 10 minus 3, 4 out of 5. Uh, I mean uh, minus 3, 8 oh, yeah. Minus 3 and 8 out of 10. Yes. So, so um, 15 minus 8 equals 15 minus 8. Equal seven over out, out uh, over ten and then three minus three equals or uh, so the answer will be seven out of ten. Thank you so much. Welcome, teacher. How do you find it now? Is it clear? Teacher, it's very clear and simple. The others are five. Yes. Teacher, actually, teacher, I didn't understand some parts. What's your name? What's your name? My name is Dina, teacher. I don't understand some parts. Dina, okay, Dina. I will need to now solve number two with me, okay? Okay. Did you finish writing? Yes, teacher. Now, number two. Nine, sorry. Nine and one over six minus two and three over four. Now look at the fractions. Do we have the same? Uh, denominator? No. No. So what, how do you make them the same denominator? How? Adina? Dina, yes, teacher. How do you make them all the same denominator? Yeah, I don't know. I know. I don't know this part too. You will see that here. Here is six, and here is four. What are the multiples of six? By the way, this is talk about them before. The yeah, a uh, table of six, six. Six times one. Six times one equals six. Six, six times two. Six times two equals twelve. Okay, four, four times four one. Four times one equals. Four times one. E uh, four times one equals four. Four times four two. Four times two equal eight. Times three. Times three is twelve. Twelve. So the common here is. Then, how do you make 6 to be 12? You multiply it by what? Multiply it by 4. By 2. How by 4? And you multiply up by 2. 1 times 2. Equal to 2. Then, how you make 4 to be 12? You multiply it by what? Multiply it by 2. By 3. By 3. And 3 times 3 is? 3 times 3 equals 9. Nine. Now then, can you subtract two or sorry nine from two? Adina? No, teacher, because the two uh, don't have enough to subtract the nine. What do you have to do next? We are going to take 
take one from nine. So it will so, be eight plus one plus two over 12. Okay, Daniela, continue. Then how you change the one to be as the fraction? What do you have to do with it? Adina? We're going to... Dina? Dina? You multiply here by 12 and here by 12. So it will be 8 plus 12 plus 2 over 12. 12 plus 2 is 14, so it comes like 8 and 14 over 12. Now, after I took my power from my father, I can come back to subtract from here. So this one, I will change it to be 8 and 14 over 12. Teacher, I want to write that too. Then I cannot really undo it. Now eight minus nine is uh, five over twelve, and eight minus two is six. So the answer is six and five over twelve. Oh. Teacher, is that all? Yes. Uh, the teacher, then I think it's uh, it's easy. But teacher, uh, 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 can you upload this vi this video up in Classera so I can uh, repeat it and see again until I know how to do it? Yeah, I will. Thank you. Okay. Number three now. Where is uh, Muna? Muna? Yes, teacher, I am Muna. Yes, Muna. Here now. Three and two over three. Minus one and 11 over 12. How do you make three to be 12, Muna? I will multiply by four and two oh. by four. So it will be three and eight over 12. Minus. 1 and 11 over 12. 12. Now, can you subtract 11 from 8? No. No. So, what do you have to do? Uh, to the 3, make it 2. Ayo, plus? Plus 12 over 12. Bravo. Okay, let's step by step. Plus 1. Plus 8 over 12. Then here is 1. Then here it comes like 1 times 12. So it's 12 over 12. Then 2 plus. Oh, 2 and. 12 plus 8. 20. 20 over 12. Bravo. Then 20. 2 and 20 over 12 minus what? 1. And 11 over 12. After I rename it now, I rename 3 and 8 over 12 with a new name, which is 2 and 20 over 12. We continue now. 20 minus yeah. 11. It's uh, 9. 9 over? Over 12. Over 12. And 2 minus 1? 1. one. One. Now nine over twelve. Can you simplify it more? Yes. By what? Dividing by what? By three. Good job. Bravo. By three. So nine divided by three. Three over four. One three and over four. four. Bravo. One and three over four. Bravo, Mona. Thanks. That's it. Now, if you finish, you can leave the meeting. Thank you so much. Okay, teacher. Have a nice day. Bye.
Bye bye. Teacher? Yes. Uh, we did, like we didn't finish the lesson. We uh, we have to solve the homework. No, tomorrow I will solve more examples. But if you understand it, you can solve it now. Okay. If you didn't keep it for tomorrow, there isn't any problem. Okay. Bye. 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 Bye teacher. Wait.